this story is going to seem crazy to you. If this wasn't something that happened to me, I would say it's crazy too. I mean, it's not every day you hear a story like this, but I can assure you, it happened. Hi, Mr. Johnson. Welcome to your new home. I got oh. your little housewarming gifts. Oh, thank you. That's so kind. You're welcome. This must be your daughter? Yeah, say hi, Monica. Hi, Monica. It's so nice to meet you. I apologize. It's a lot of change. Mm. My wife, she grew up here. I'm sorry. Mommy grew up here? She did. Ah, so that's why you were so eager to buy the place. Yeah, when I heard it was for sale, I felt, I just knew Monica needed to grow up here too. Well, I guess it makes this house even more special. Daddy, can I go play in the yard? Of course you can. Just be careful, okay? Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. I'm feeling lonely. Oh, I wish I found a lover that could hold me. Now I'm crying in my room. Okay, I guess I'll leave you to it. Enjoy this beautiful house. I will. Thanks again for everything. Anytime. Bye now. Bye. Hi, Monica. I'm Alice. Want to be friends? What the? How? <laughs> wow, this is cool. Hi, Alice. How'd you get my letter? Do you know how this is happening? I opened my mailbox and there it was. I guess the same way you're getting mine. It's like a magic mailbox. It's like you're right here with me just handing me your letters. Hi. Oh, uh, hi. I'm Violet. I'm Monica. I saw you doing some cheer routine next door. Uh, are you a cheerleader? Um, not really. Um, I just do it because I'm super hyper and I drive my mom crazy. Understandable. What's that? Nothing. Um, okay. Want to play? What do you want to play? How about... Soccer. I don't play soccer. Everybody around here plays soccer. How about we bake cookies? My mom buys cookies from the bakery. Oh, well, my mom and I used to bake cookies. Yeah. Well, you don't know how to play soccer, so I guess I'll go. Yeah, uh, see you around? Yeah, bye. Mm -hmm. Hey, I know it feels weird going to sleep in a new place. That's why I made sure I unpacked this first. Mom. I miss her too, kiddo. She loved you so much. I know. Maybe when she was your age, this was her room. In a way, it's like she's still here with us. All right, it's time to get some sleep, okay? Have a good night, all right? Love you. Love you. I miss you, Mommy. Mommy, I miss you. At nights, I just wish you were here with me. 
so we could laugh and talk again. Mommy, I miss you, but I will just kiss you and send it on. Cause you know, I can't see you again. Good night, Mom. Hey, Monica, what are you doing? Nothing much. I forgot to ask you yesterday, are you going to LV Elementary? What's that? Long Valley Elementary School. You do go to school. Right? Uh, yeah, I do. Of course I do. Uh, just, um... Hey, I know what it's like to be the new kid on the block. It's nerve-wracking. But there's nothing to worry about. Everybody around here is friendly and cool. I'm sure you're gonna fit right in. That's good news, I guess. Plus, I'm your new BFF now, so there's absolutely nothing to worry about. I see you don't talk much. Oh, I'm not trying to ignore you, be rude or anything. It's just, uh... I want you to see what happens when I put this letter into that mailbox. Okay, um... Now what? Does a bunny jump out of the box or something? I'll just show you, but whatever happens, you promise you won't tell anyone, okay? Okay. Don't even blink. I'm gonna miss it. Monica? Yeah? Can I blink now? My eyes are burning. Weird, she usually responds within 10 seconds. Who? Alice. Yeah, well, maybe your magic trick will work next time. Violet, come home, dinner's ready. Coming, Mom! She's annoying. Anyways, gotta go. Bye. Bye. Hi, Monica. I got your letter. Not doing much. What are you doing? Just sitting here in my backyard, hoping to hear back from you. Well, I'm here ready to chit-chat away. <laughs> so, what kind of music do you like? I like the Bee Gees, I like Queen, I even like the Beatles. My dad listens to them all the time. My dad listens to that music too. He grew up listening to those bands. My dad grew up in the 70s. He's 48 now. You're so funny. How did he grow up in the 70s? That means you wouldn't even be born yet, silly. Earth to Alice, come back to 2023. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm confused. I don't know about you, but I'm more than sure it's 1982. <laughs> Real funny. I have to go, though. I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Oh, here's a photo of me and Ariana Grande's new CD. You're going to love it. Send me a picture of you. I got your photo and this weird shiny disc thing. When I saw your photo, I felt this feeling as if I know you my whole life. Let's talk tomorrow, okay? Have a good night, Monica. So, good first day of school today? 
It was okay, I guess. Just okay? I'm sure you made at least one new friend. Thanks for picking up Monica from school today. No problem, I had time on my hands. Uh, can I offer you something to drink, some coffee? I have to go to class in 10, I gotta run. All right, I'll see you tomorrow at work then. See you at work tomorrow, Tom. What's all this stuff? Well, I had a day myself, sweetheart. Um, I got to clean up all the garbage the previous owners left behind. From where? From the backyard? Oh, from the basement, from the garage, everywhere these people left garbage. My mailbox! Honey. I'm so sorry, honey. I didn't know it meant so much to you. Someone must have took it from the trash. When I picked up the mailbox, an envelope fell out. I put really? the envelope. Yeah, I put the envelope on the back porch. Hi, Monica. Here is a picture of me. My dad took it yesterday. I live in Long Valley, New Jersey. It can't be. Mommy?